Many people incorrectly assume that color is a property of matter. However, color is not a property of matter, but color is dependent upon the frequencies of light that reach our eyes from that object. This black folder is not black because it absorbed black. It's black because it absorbed the red, the green, and the blue coming from the white light in this room and reflected none of those colors. The white background behind me is white because it didn't absorb any of the colors. It reflected the red, the green, and the blue. So the color that an object has is dependent upon the color that reaches our eyes, that reflects off of it if it's opaque. Other colors are absorbed and we don't see them. This folder is red not because it absorbed red and became red, it's red because it absorbed green and blue and reflected the red to our eyes. This blue folder is blue because it reflected the blue to our eyes, but it absorbs the red and green. The green folder is green because it reflects green to our eyes, but the red and blue are absorbed. This folder is cyan. Cyan absorbs its complement, red, and it reflects blue and green. When blue and green come to our eyes, we interpret that as that baby blue color called cyan. This is a magenta folder. Magenta absorbs green and reflects the red and blue back to our eyes, and we see that as magenta. The yellow folder absorbs blue, and it reflects red and green to our eyes, so we see it as yellow. These folders will not look these exact same colors when white light isn't shining on them. The color of an opaque object not only depends on what color it reflects, but it also depends on the colors that shine on it. In the next video clip, you'll see these same folders, how their colors change when different colors of light shine on them.